Hello, I am Tim LaHaye 432. Hi noobs, my name is I Don't Scam. We are here today, to mourn in remembrance of the tragic, shitty and murderous updates that the jam tax have committed on the year of the 2007, 12th month on the day before the day, that marked two weeks to go before Christmas. Excuse his language, he means the 10th of December 2007. Gajex decided to practically cripple the purrs, merchants, stakers, scammers, well basically anyone who did not skill the long way for money. I was not there at the time of the riot but I heard it was practically the worst riot in the history of RuneScape of all time, even worse than the Swift Switch riots. Let us bow our heads in prayer, while wearing something pink to mourn for our loved ones who have moved on to games which actually offer a democratic, free trading, non-biased game. All wear pink now please, or the creator of RuneScape, Guthix, will be mad. Er uh, yes. Anyway if you were not at the riot, to get an insight of what happened on that day, you would have to go look on the forums in the news and announcements section and look in YouTube for it too. There is a lot of evidence on both of these sources to suggest that the Gajex traders are making these reasons for this tragic update up, this is why many people rant it. Yay, I heard that approximately 98% of players quit the game, and 1% got banned by the jam tax dictators. They are so fucking greedy it's unbelievable, they want to rake our money in, that's why they got rid of customer support too, so we could not ask them about stuff. It's so fucking unfair, because like the wilderness is gone, and their newest updates, since they aren't even like 10% as good as old wildy, all they need to do, is bring it back, but they are like too scared of admitting, that they were wrong, so they make up random shit and conspiracies like this real world item trading versus runescape shit, that does not even make sense, cause like RS can just make their own GPN. Sell it to the real world items traders, and like everyone will be happy, because it will not be disrupting the game anymore. As you can see from the posts on this thread from some two years ago, called Wilderness and more lots of people, wanted everyone to log out at 8pm GMT, maybe we should all log out at 10pm GMT, to show the jam tax just how angry we are about an update, that was released two years ago. It's not fair jam tax, why do you ruin the game for us paying customers? We pay we say we pay we say we pay we say. They had also ruined free trade and put in these shitty limits that they expect us to use, yet people just got around it using junk, GF Gajex. It's actually sad that the Gajex is based in the United Kingdom which is a western great power in the world, happens to now control prices for our items, and that my friends, is communism and you lot already have seen what communism does, it creates cold wars and mass unemployment in non-African third world countries, it's disgusting, looks like Gajex are but raying their own country. Another example is to see how many British worlds there are, only like six, poor Gajex, very poor. The jam tax are a bunch of meatloaf shitheads who want our IRL shiny GPs, but we have the power to change their greedy manipulative ways, please support our rant, because we fucking own, and we will kill the runescape villain minimum natty aka the Andrew Gower, mod MMG and the jam tax, we pay we say we pay we say we pay we say, can everyone who still dislikes the wildy removal please log out at 10pm GMT for 10 whole minutes. Plus, remember to wear something pink while writing. KK thanks bye.